dead, and welcome to Cooking with Short-Term Memory Loss. Okay, so you know what to do now? Yeah, I got it, I got it. Okay, ready? Action! Oh. Cut. First off, you're probably wondering why I'm wearing a ski mask. Well, you never know what's going to happen when you're cooking short-term memory loss. <laughs> Today we're making cosmic brownies. Now, the first tip I have is you always want to keep your ingredients full to the top. So, after you use them, you know if you have used them or not. Our first ingredient is eggs. Oh, it looks like we don't have any. So that's my second tip. Always keep a grocery list. Eggs! I guess we'll just have to skip the eggs. Now it's time to add the flour. You want to even them out? Oops, it looks like I forgot the eggs. I'll have to write that down on my grocery list. Eggs. Well, we don't have any eggs, so now it's time to add the flour. Now, the flour is not full. And I know this means something, but I'm not sure what. But, I'll add the flour anyway. Now it's time to stir. Stir this good now. Oh no! It looks like I forgot the eggs. What's wrong with me today? Now it's time to add the brownies. Always remember to take off the wrapper. This is coming together real nice. Now it's time to bake. Remember, you always want to wear gloves because you could burn your fingers. Okay, what you want to you want to do, put that on the top rack. Shut it. Bake for about 400 degrees for about 20 minutes. Our brownie concoction should be done any minute now. Remember, always wear gloves. Mmm, ah! looks scrumptious, don't it? Now that we got our scrumptious treat, it's all ready to eat. But first, thanks to my second helpful tip, we got to check our grocery list for next week. Let's see here. Eggs. Eggs. What kind of an idiot wrote that? <laughs>